You know what you're doing. Nah, I just build stuff. Well, let's go to school. Alrighty. I don't even know who you are. It's just a bloody hoodie. What about him? Why does he get to wear a hoodie? What's he doing? Come and get your love. You're out of uniform. But sir, everyone's out of uniform. It's inevitable. I am inevitable. What have you done? Hey Sean, what's our next Mufti theme? <laughs> WWE wrestlers, eh Sean? What? We can have student versus teachers wrestling comps. We can have costume comps. It'll be great. We can have a wrestling ring in the hall. We can have all sorts of things. And I might finally be able to fight Nathan. Sean, I don't feel too good. Hey, Sean. Hey, Sean. Sean. Hey, Sean. Sean, what happened? Oh, We've got to do something about Percy. He's too strict and unpredictable. We don't know what he's capable of. I know exactly what he's capable of. He wiped out half a fatal field with a snap of his fingers. I lost my best mate. The king of fatal. Guys, he's done it. What have you done? We need to do something about this. We need to fight back. All of us. Jarvis, assemble the wolf guy. No offense, but I think we need more people. Yeah, you're probably right. Oh, superheroes. Oh, we forget anything. Ah, oh, wait a minute. What's he doing? Takes me a while to get it up sometimes.
We have to do something about these kids out of uniform. Sick of it. I know, let's turn the school into a private school. I see this as an absolute win. What's that? <laughs> I am Groot. Mothra. You're the jerk of the way. Fresh water. I've had enough of that, mate. I am sports captain. We nearly lost our hoodies and Converse to Percy and his gang of teachers. But as a cohort, we band together to bring our friends and clothing back. After the events that nearly wiped out the school, bringing us all closer together, we decided to interview some students. Over to you, Adam. I'm Adam Pristis, and today all the students have been returned after they got snapped away. So we're going to be going around the school, ask them a few questions, what they've missed, what were their favourite moments, and yeah. Prince Mohan, what was your favourite moment of Freshwater this year? Um, probably all of it. Any people you'd like to thank this year for your success? Um, Daniel Chambers, he supported me through everything, my ups and downs, yeah. Yeah, Daniel's a good man, I agree with that. What's something you're going to miss about Freshy? My friends. Aww. Aww. <laughs> What's your favourite thing about your friends? Our favourite moment about Freshy is probably... Zone. Balling. Yeah. And when Ellie got hit in the head. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah. Dropping the guitar on stage. Playing frisbee on the oval. That was good. Tell me, Rory, what was your favourite moment of Freshwater so far? Probably barging into Miss Miltiati's ancient history classes saying ancient history is bad. Since modern history is better, it is. Now, Rory, tell me, who would you like to thank for this year? Um, do you want me to thank you? Yeah. I don't want to. What will you miss most about this year? Um, just like the really strong friendships that I've made. I think, yeah, just the friends that I'm gonna miss. <laughs> They're gonna miss seeing everyone every day. I've really just loved the community I've met at Freshwater. Um, probably friends. The new Instagram followers. Um, the chippies from the canteen. <laughs> Guy, tell me, what was your favourite moment of Freshwater this year? Um, well, we all went down and uh, picked up Grandma's bean curd from um, the Me Too Cafe just down the road. Um, hitting all the Year 11's cars. What was your favourite moment in Freshwater this year? Um, all the sports carnivals. Oh, well. <laughs> do we have to do it again now? <laughs> when Arthur and Sienna somehow happened to break a bone playing handball. Winning all the carnivals and getting the bird. I quite like 
making friends. Is there anyone like you'd like to thank for this year? Um, Miss Chetty and the SLSO. The teachers. Mr. Picard and all the staff, as well as all my friends. They're really, really helpful. <laughs> and what do you... It's the lovely office ladies. Thank you for helping me with my late slips all the time. <laughs> and what's one moment you're going to miss, or what are you going to miss from Freshwater? Um, my friends being forced to come see me every day. Um, me and Claudia are going to miss Mr. Pauly. Oh, Mr. Pauly! Oh, so I'd just like to ask, what are you going to miss about our year group? I'm going to miss the fact that this is the best group that I've ever taught. And that goes back 40 years. Sorry, kind words. Yeah. Claudia and Ren particularly. Shout out to them, eh? Yeah. Were they your favourite students? Uh, no. What's your favourite thing about Freshwater? My favourite thing is about the students. So tell me, what are you going to miss after you graduate from Freshwater? I think just everything, you know, all the people and teachers, the routine. Now tell me, what was your favourite moment of Freshwater this year so far? Um, I would have to say English with Miss Perry is always fun. Yes. And who would you like to thank for this year? Um, probably Miss Carney because she makes legal studies so much more fun and she's always very sassy with me, so it's always a fun time with her. So thank you, Miss Carney. Oh, year 12, I didn't see you there. Well, what a roller coaster our last two years have been. From learning how to surf at Long Reef Beach to the pressure of prelim exams, half yearlies, trials, the assemblies, the assessments, the mufti days, the Monday afternoons in the library, the sports carnivals, the winning of the bird, and now finally your graduation. Now, even though I teach about parenting and caring in community and family studies, my role as a year advisor has really given me an insight into motherhood and what to expect. Throughout the last two years, I've been a relationship counselor, a therapist, a motivator, a shoulder to cry on, a disciplinarian. Now, particularly when it comes to uniforms, Reuben Westaway, I am looking at you. A role model, and most importantly, a fashion advisor for the formal. You have been an interesting year group, keeping us year advisors on your toes, but that is what makes you unique. So thank you, class of 2019. To all the future lawyers, physios, engineers, musicians, and our next Olympians, fashion designers, tradies, and our next generation of teachers, I wish you all the best. Good luck in your HSC and beyond. And please remember, you're now part of the Freshie family. You're always welcome back. Oh, right, let's get out of here. Oh, year 12, oh, hello, how are you going? Oh, I was just going home. You want us to say a few words about my experience with year 12? Look, from the both of us, it's been a fantastic two years. Yeah. We've enjoyed the whole time. I think year 12 are some of the most exceptional students I've met at this school in a lot of years. So look, for year 12, all the best for the future, all the best for the exams, and make sure you just go out and enjoy yourself. Thank you. Hi year 12s, I can't believe it's been two years since you walked through those doors. This is when I started at Freshy too, so you'll always be very special to me. You are now in charge of your own destiny, and may all your dreams come true both now and in the future. And one last thing, if you can't be good, please be careful. So long, farewell, I'll feed us saying goodbye. Goodbye. Cut. <laughs> Cut.